Unless you live under a rock, you know who KFC Clash is. After watching his videos, he inspired me to beat Clash Royale with a glizzy. And so, the glizzy grind began. So, this is 2000 trophies. We're kind of beating everybody, and we're three crowned a couple people doing really well, but it was like getting progressively harder because I wasn't like leveling up as much here, and I hadn't. I only had Log, and Log isn't really the best legendary for a spell. And then we had the craziest moment happen right here. This interaction, watching it back even, is just so funny. Um, we go, go for the King Tower activation, and I rocket the mini Pekka, thinking I'm really smart, you know? Like, it's gonna defend it, and uh, yeah. Insert the intense music. So normally I would not show this, except we did this twice in a row and I thought maybe it would be important for you guys. We activate King Tower here and he ends up going freeze and I thought it was crazy because the game after this, somebody else does literally the exact same play and goes Mega Knight uh, Ewas at the bridge and we do literally the same thing so I thought it was important. Glizzy time. Does it work on a screen? We're about to find out. It does. It does. So let's check the arena. Oh my god, it's almost like a stylus. It's almost it's almost better than just using your hand. <laughs> okay. Alright. Here we go. Okay, we lost on our first attempt, but that was not enough to discourage me from my ultimate dream of becoming the first person in Clash Royale to beat it with a hot dog. Right here, the defensive sequence falls apart because the glizzy is really hard to make precise placements. We even messed up the ice spirit here, and so it gets taken down by the rogue ghost, and we ended up almost losing our tower here, which, yeah, not good, not good, not what you wanna see. But he does mess up his bats here, which allows us to get so much damage. We take over a third of his tower here, which is absolutely insane. So now I'm thinking, like, at this point in the game, like, we can come back. Like, we can come back. I already, I've already attempted this challenge one time before, so I'm pretty scared. I do not want to have to, like, keep on touching my phone screen with a hot dog. Trust me. So Valkyrie's coming down the lane. I think he just goes for the mini P.E.K.K.A. here. Yeah, he goes mini P.E.K.K.A., so we're gonna go for the early Inferno Tower in the middle, because I'm, like I said, I'm scared of that Princess of the Bridge, and I really do not want to have to deal with it, um, because then we're gonna have to spend our Glog, and, uh, yeah, he'll still get, like, a guaranteed shot. We go Ice Spirit here, and he actually goes for the Princess into the Ice Spirit to block it, which is actually kind of insane, to be honest, like, I'm not really too sure why he did that, but I also played my Princess into his Princess, so I guess you could also say, why would I do that? right here i go for the skeleton army and um yeah so if i was using my hand i would have never messed up that skeleton army and that giant skeleton would have never connected but this just proves that it's actually kind of difficult to use a hot dog because right there like i was not trying to let that connect but yet it did so he goes real ghost at the bridge i think we do predict his princess at one point we go ice spirit here and princess of the bridge just trying to get some like extra damage and i think i do go yeah i go in the back just trying to keep that um giant skeleton in the back unfortunately that mini tech survives and right here i'm so happy because i know it's at 83 all we have to do is predict the princess with the inferno we go early inferno predicting the princess if we didn't go for that early inferno i think he actually would have won this game so we got super lucky there we go skeleton army at the bridge and ice spirit just in case he goes for the zap on the skeleton army and yeah just barely out of range with the giant skeleton we go princess right on top of his princess unfortunately um that happened yeah i should have like i was just like choking right here i go like early log instead of just logging his tower we go valk on defense this is like an intense defense right because i'm trying so hard not to lose no way we beat somebody with a glizzy let's go let's go boys we beat somebody with a glizzy we beat somebody with a glizzy oh 
Let's go! We beat somebody with a glancy! I know you guys were wondering what I did with that hot dog after. I ate it. Peace!